Good morning, everybody! I hope you're having a fantastic day so far. So I had a sales call earlier that went really, really well. And I did not close the business. So you're probably thinking, how did a sales call go really, really well and you not close the business? Doesn't that mean it went really poorly? No. You should not close everyone you talk to. You should not close everyone you work with. And here is why. Sometimes there's obstacles that even if you did close the business would keep you from being successful with the prospect, with the client. So in this scenario, we were looking at putting together an entire event and how it would flow, how it would work, who needed to do what. And you know what? One of the biggest obstacles that we ran into was self-limiting beliefs. What could I do? What could I offer? And while there is some truth to uh, the discussion, my opinion is most of that is internal. Most of what we couldn't overcome or couldn't address was internal beliefs, and that's okay. It is not my job or your job as a sales professional to change anybody's mind. It's your job to help them discover whether or not this is a good fit. And through our sales process, we discovered it really wasn't a good fit for right now. And we may work together in the future, but right now we're gonna go our separate ways and they're gonna work on some getting some stuff ironed out in their business before we put on a full-blown event. So I just wanted to come in and share that I did lose a sale, but you can't lose anything you don't have. So didn't really lose it. All things considered, it was a great meeting. We left as friends, which is how every sales call should end. One way or another, leaving as friends. And we're here if they need help. They are always welcome to come back to us. But you've got to make sure as you're in sales, as you're helping people, as you're working with people, you have to make sure that you're looking for, is this in their best interest and in my best interest? And if it's not, don't do it. And me and my partner talked a lot about this opportunity over the weekend. And we got to the point where if they wanted to move forward, we could help them and it would be a fun, profitable event. But if they didn't, that'd be good for us too because there's a lot of factors go into it. But it is not a make or break it. So make sure as you're going through your sales process, as you're working through things, that you're looking at the big picture, not just the right now picture. It is so easy to get zoned in on right now. This is what I need. I've got to figure this out. I've got to figure it out. But guess what? If you look down the road, if you look at where you're going, that focus, that intense focus on right now might be hampering you getting there. So I, I am super excited with how the sales call turned out. And it was an amazing learning experience for us as we were getting our process dialed in with our sales process. Because we're new. We're what, three months old? That's all right. So I just wanted to get on here and encourage you. You don't have to close every business. And in fact, you shouldn't. Sales is a discovery process. You need to help your prospects discover whether or not they should buy from you whether or not you want to work with them. That's what sales is. So I just want you to keep that in mind as you're going through your day, as you're going through your week, and as you're going through your life. It's okay to get a no. And if you're getting 100% closes, you are doing it wrong. I promise you, either you're not charging enough or you're selling everybody. There is zero reason, zero reason, anyone should have a 100% close ratio. So if you do, look at where you're going wrong because I promise you, you're selling people who should not be sold 
or you're charging way too little for what you do offer. So, with all that said, I hope you have a fantastic day. And I hope you go out and don't close business that's not supposed to be closed. So, with that said, I'll talk to y'all real soon and have a wonderful day.